Nui Pic was established in 1947, well before the Clean Up Water Act was really in the thinking of anybody in power, right? Um, and our organization really laid a foundation that led to the Clean Water Act. I think it's worth noting that that great sort of revolution of the use of water power, which is central to the Northeast in many respects, led to a really bad degradation and pollution of these beautiful waters. They turned colors based on what textiles were being made at the time. Um, they were seen as open sewers. And the Clean Water Act was thought of and established really to fix that problem for us. Work that Nui Pick does every day to help implement the Clean Water Act, really I'll focus on two things. One is that we still today establish and support the states in establishing water quality standards, which are used to evaluate how clean and pristine the water is. We also have a number of staff that ensure that this water and many waters like it are tested regularly. The monitoring that goes into ensuring the quality of our nation's waters is really paramount to us understanding how much work we have left to do. I'd say number one for me is I think about the workforce. Many of the people that are senior level executives and leaders in this industry are about as old or older than the Clean Water Act. And we really need more young people to get into this field. There is room for everyone and we really need you. So really here in the Northeast, communities were established literally hundreds of years ago, hundreds of years ago. And all of that buildup and infrastructure that goes to support those communities is that old. We have so much work to do to rebuild our nation's infrastructure, really foundationally, including the water infrastructure. So I think there are three things that make me most hopeful about the future. The first is that on a national scale, Congress, and the executive branch have made real big investments in our water infrastructure and our infrastructure as a country, which is desperately needed. So number one. Number two is that every time we talk about diversifying the field, we are improving the sustainability of our industry into the future. We have room for everyone that wants to protect water and we want them in this group. The diversity will make us better. Number three is that Nui Pick does tons of outreach and educational programs. And when you see a kid's face light up when they understand how water works or how we protect it or how it gets cleaned up when it's been polluted, that's magical.